Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Wolf Wraith and welcome back to our Let's Play of Rogue Trooper Redux. Continuing with the next campaign. This time, I am starting on the main menu, so don't miss out on any potential cutscenes. Fuck, see this is it, what is this inconsistency, huh? I was hoping it was going to take me to a nice little cutscene. Oh wow, you know what I realised? Like, all these maps they're showing you and stuff? I reckon Rogue Trooper could potentially be a decent open world game. Then again, I really say that about everything. Everything could really make a decent open world game. Uh, actually, that wouldn't be too bad. Having, if Rogue Trooper 2, not, if they didn't go, not necessarily open world, but more like open in terms of being less linear. Not that this one's all that linear, but I mean, it does give you a very minute amount of openness, but that's more in the way that you can approach the mission as opposed to giving you the ability to sort of approach from any different direction on the battlefield. That is loud. Why so loud? What is this, a church? Are we going to church? See, one of the things that I like about this is that it's kind of, kind of straight to the point in some ways. Yeah, looks like our Grand Admiral doesn't want his meeting to be disturbed. Wonder who he's expecting. Not us, that's for sure. Come on, guys, let's go pay our respects. See, so, like it, it has these cutscenes here, yeah, and that's about it. Now. Grand Admiral Hoffer is close by. The data mentioned a cathedral. See, like, it, it doesn't have any cutscenes in the middle of the game, if that makes any sense. Oh shit, I didn't have my silencer on. Really not a fan- that grenade throw is pathetic, man. Oh shit. That actually got him. <laughs> I did not expect that to happen. Have I got my silencer on now? I do, okay. Oh shit. I see you there, buddy. You didn't see that one coming. Hey, what the fuck? See, this is the tactical shit I can do in the game that I really want to do. So we're gonna we're gonna make a if it can fucking get away from this sticky ass combat uh, cover. I mean, what the fuck? Oh my god, this shooting it needs work. It really needs work. I can't remember what I was saying just before as well. Oh yeah, I was talking about how the game is, uh, it's very direct, doesn't have, like, cutscenes in the middle of gameplay and stuff like that. Which I kind of think is why I generally enjoyed my experience with it the first time. Is because it's, it's heavily, it's more gameplay oriented. And it's still, it's still able to have a story there as well. And it's not necessarily a great- get to higher ground. There's no way past on this level. It's not necessarily a great story, but it's not a bad one either. Like, it's not... What? Not like Witcher level of shit. But, you know, it's still a pretty decent decent story. I, I, can't, I would love to see them expand on this. I reckon they could have made a franchise. But I, I actually feel like it needs a reboot. This Redux is not... Is not a good place for them to, to start. I think if they do a reboot... Basically keep the story and everything as it is, keep the gameplay as it is to some extent, but revamp things here and there, change the, the shooting, have the ability to switch shoulders, and get rid of this, like, like what the fuck, how am I supposed to see what I'm shooting? Fucking, this, this, get rid of that bullshit, change the cover system, and you'd have a pretty good game. Maybe add a, 
I, I guess the dialogue is alright. The dialogue happens during gameplay, so that's pretty good. Oh, shit. And add subtitles for these radio announcements. takes care of them. See, they also need to fix that. Like, what's the point of having an, a, an aiming uh, crosshair if I can't shoot what I can see? See that? Like, what the fuck is happening there? Hey, hey, hey. That's, I, I jumped to the left and it's still, like this, get, get rid of this shit, please. I can't see what I'm shooting. I cannot see what I'm shooting. Like, they gotta fix that. It needs a reboot. If they can reboot it, I reckon they could create a whole universe and have some decent lore involved with this. Maybe even um, start with the prequel to how Rogue became like this soldier because it's genetically modified, so I'd love to see I'd love to see it focus on maybe Rogue before he was genetically modified, if that's even a possibility. That would be interesting. Let me at him. That would be really cool, actually, because apparently the co-op missions in this focus on Rogue. Oh shit. So yeah, apparently the co-op missions focus on... It's like a prequel. It's like a prequel to this game. Oh god. I'm so, I'm so sorry you're having to watch this. There we go. Hey! Bagman, help! Gunner, whatever your fucking name is. Holy shit. There was something that the reviews noted as well, that the game felt a bit sluggish. Like, you see how... See how he, he goes out like that? And see how long he takes? And even weapon switching was considered, uh... Uh, what do you call it? Very sluggish? Oh, yeah, that's something else they need to fix, yeah. The, the cover system being so sticky needs to go. Like, what is happening there? The AI needs to be not be as bullet spongy. Camera angles fixed. If they can do that, I reckon they'll have something good. Wait a second. Didn't I just come through there? I did. <laughs> just looting all these corpses, holy shit. Cause yeah, this is a, it's a good game. I mean, you're gonna hear me ragging on it. I'm always gonna rag on games to piss me off. Like when I'm pissed off, I just can't help it. I'm pissed off. What do you expect me to do? Hey! See if I can get him through the fence. Yes, I can. Now there's a sniper somewhere. Oh, this is where I should have used the decoy. Shit. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Reveal yourself. Is he up there somewhere? No way. Where is he? Aha! I see you. Now, I'm not going to use the stabilizer, because I don't need it. I'm too badass for a stabilizer. 
<laughs> it's such a stupid fucking thing. <laughs> I am an idiot. <laughs> Fuck. Oh man. Oh shit. What's the point of having Gunner, like, put a little circle thing there? Uh, now just gotta be careful I don't get ambushed by anything or anyone here. Oh fuck. Oh fuck, it's gonna happen. Where's the chopper? Where's the chopper? Hey! What the fucking bullshit? Oh, come on. How do they know where I am? This is... That's another thing that needs to change. This... This bullshit honing AI. Like, it makes no sense that they... They, they did not know I was there. And yet, they're, sh they're able to shoot me. Okay, we got a clip there, so I think I might save that. Now, it looks like there's a... Uh, ooh... Oh, Jesus. Is that gonna heal up? Yeah, the AI that just hones in on you doesn't... It makes no sense. I mean, I probably ignored it back then. Probably because back then it was sort of... Expected? Like, they... People, like... They didn't really give a shit about that sort of thing back then. Whereas now, you would look at it and go... Well, that's just poor game design. So back then, yeah, you were like, oh, whatever. Enemies can see- ooh. Ooh, I thought that was a thing. One of those blue thingies. You'd be like, oh yeah, enemies found me, whatever, that's- that's just- that's just the game. Back then, it didn't matter if, like, an enemy can see you through a wall or something like that. Well, if they saw you through a wall, you'd probably be pissed off. But... Honing AI was just sort of like, whatever. You sort of thought it was the norm back then, whereas now, it, you, you're like, if, if AI can see you... ...not necessarily through walls and shit... Oh fuck, this, this cover system is so inconsistent. See what I mean? Why is it- why am I shooting the fucking cover and not the enemy that I'm aiming at? Stupid. They could have fucking fixed that in the Redux. It's practically a mod. Like, they could have modded it. That was something else that I noticed on Steam. People are getting a little bit pissy about the price of this. Uh, saying that for the, for the price that it's at. They could have easily just done it as like a... An expansion or DLC. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh fuck, what just happened? What just happened there? I wanted to flank them, but like, it's like as soon as I tried, it was like, uh. Is it this area of the game? Ah, so they're using EMP is the same way that I do. Okay, interesting. See, this is kind of like having a, a, an AI buddy helping you out. <laughs> they really don't like that. Can I... Can I salvage this guy? Oh! Oh shit! My first death! Yes, return to the check the point. Okay, go, 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 now, 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 now. Now, 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 place, place, place. Place, place, place. Get out of there, get out of there! What are you doing, Rope? Fuck! You no hyper, you're supposed to be the rogue trooper. You're the rogue dickhead. That's what you are. The rogue dickhead. Go, okay, keep me covered, keep me covered. That's some real good cover fire, you dickhead. 
Oh, I remember this area. This area can get hard. Wait, what the fuck is he doing? <laughs> oh, he's turning around. I'm like, why is he like... Oh, uh, that was funny. See ya. Oh my god, that... I'm so used to pressing square to reload or something, and he fucking does that. What the fuck? What was that? What the fuck was that bullshit? They could have fixed the bugs at the very fucking least. Oh my god. Alright, we got him, we got him, we got him. I remember the first time I did this area now. It was pretty daunting having to fight these two two robot things. I was like, oh my god, no way. Here we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wrong grenade. That was easier than I remember. <laughs> that part definitely was. It's kind of funny, I like the fact that they make it that you have to pick up the helm before it'll open the door. Anything? Anything I should be worried about? How did they... They're not even the same... Not even in the same area and they hurt me. What the fuck, man? What is this? What is this dodgy... Oh fuck. I kind of feel like uh, I'm playing Metal Gear in, in, in some sense. He's <laughs> gonna come running. Man, he did not attract shit. Get him, get him, yeah! <laughs> Oh wow, so that, that actually killed him. Come up behind him. Yeah! It's like the best thing in the whole game, man. Oh, it's like he was looking right at me. Holy shit. Let's see if I can get some shots off. Ooh, hello. Great shot. Damn right, that was amazing shot. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> just picking them off one by one. I love it. Oh, that one's gonna be a bit of a hard shot. I don't think I want to do that one. Fear the GI Nords. Oh, there's two. Wonder if I could get a two for one. Gotcha. Oh, that was a shot. That was a shot to behold. Gotcha. Oh, yes. See, I like the fact that you can kind of see where they are because they give off smoke, but a lot of areas in this map have smoke as well. Sort of like someone's breathing in cold weather, if you know what I mean. Oh shit, I can't see anything because of the light. See what I mean? You can see that little that little puff of smoke. There, there, there. But then you can see it everywhere else, so it's sort of like, oh, is there someone there, or is that just the environment that's doing that? Looks like a welcoming committee. Some people just don't take a hint. Oh shit, that is a different boss. The question is, will it see me from here? Ah, oh, fuck, it will!
Okay, we've got to figure out a tactic for beating this thing now. How are we going to beat it? Scrambler? Let's use the scrambler. The mortar might come in handy. Don't get too close. Is there two enemies or just the one? Okay, so there's a there's a gun guy thing there as well. So here's what we're gonna do. I don't know if we can lure him out. Uh just in case. Reporting for sentry duty. Come and get me. <laughs> Come on, cunt. Use the wrong grenade. Whoa! Whoa! What's going on? Why can't I do anything? Oh, because I don't have gunner. Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, at least I got the, um, the idiot that was there. Okay, how are we going to destroy this? How are we going to destroy this thing? Oh my god, that actually worked. Oh my god, I cannot believe that actually worked. We did it. That was our first boss battle. Congratulations, my friend. Thanks to the information you provided, the massacre of the GIs in the Quartz Zone has been almost a 100% success. Your praise is appreciated, Grand Admiral Hoffer, as is your fine Norland brandy. But what I really want from you is the payment I was promised. Full payment will be received once we can confirm that all the GIs have been eliminated. According to some reports, it's possible at least one of them may have survived. What's happening? See the building! What's happening? Answer me! Your men are dead, Admiral. And I'm afraid our arrangement has changed. What are you talking about? I can't allow that my identity could be discovered. No! Wait, what? Oh, because he can't breathe in the air. That's smart. I love that. He could have shot him, but he chose to, to make him suffer instead. Information came from one of your own. A traitor. Who? Tell me, and I won't kill you. I like that. It's like, tell me, and I won't kill you, but he's gonna let him die. I said anyway. I wouldn't kill you. I didn't say anything about helping you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, good on him. The traitor! He's escaping! driving oh yeah look at that enemies killed 22 headshots hell yeah shots fired 440 that's horrible 35 minutes that's a load of crap i've been playing for 44 but hopefully you guys enjoyed that one that video went 
better than the other one. Better than the previous one. Less frustration, so that's a plus. Uh, if you did enjoy it, please let me know in the comments down below. And you should also let me know what you prefer. Do you prefer stealth, or do you prefer going at guns blazing, or do you prefer a bit of a hybrid approach? A bit of a, uh, let's uh, let Gunner go on one side, and then we'll stealth kill the enemies from the other. Or, I don't know, what are your tactics that you like? Anyways, I'm going to end that one there. Thank you so much for watching, and as usual, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you in the next video.